This is our Moriseki um, flatbed turning center. Obviously, the back side of the machine, uh, the front side is a little close to another machine, so it's kind of tight quarters. Um, the chip conveyor, as you see here, is not currently plugged in. Um, we have uh, the rest of the machine here under power. We have a small program in it. We'll run it uh, to show you some basic movements. The machine is wired at 220 volts, three phase. There's a hydraulic system plumbed in. This is our weight right here. We weigh most all the machines, so 17,000 pounds is what the machine weighs. A shot of your screen. The screen, uh, I mean, has a little bit of burning, but for the machine's age, I would consider the screen to be in fairly good condition. And here's all your hard switches and buttons. Open up 10T control. Um, the um, previous specs and photos may show the machine with a set of top jaws. I don't have them anymore, so there are no top jaws with the machine. We have, we have the chuck here, the master jaws. The chuck works, but it simply does not have top jaws. Tail stock, a tool changer. There's the foot pedal. There's chips and dirt. We actually haven't really got a chance to clean this thing up uh, really well. Uh, being an older machine, we honestly don't spit and polish them as well as others. Can you work the tailstock for me, quick, and we'll then we'll run the program. And there we're studying the quill. And there's movement forward on the tailstock. We move back. That's pretty much all you do with them. So then we have a small program queued up here. We'll. And that's it. Those are just basic rapid and feed movements and then three different speeds we programmed into it um, just to give you an idea how it sounds, which again for its age uh, isn't that bad. So um, that is uh, the overall of the machine basically. Uh, review the video here and feel free to ask any questions. Thank you. Oh. We'll get the chuck jaws there before I... Might be a little hard to see, but the chuck works, the jaws work, so. So, if there are any questions, feel free to ask.